Hi everyone, it's Anna here from Country Chic. Um, I got a, a haul video for you today of Dollar Tree and a flea market I went to. I'm recording outside today on our um, top backyard porch, so it'll be a little different if you hear a little traffic. That's what it's from. Um, I will just get started. Um, I will start with the Dollar Tree and then I will do the flea market stuff. To start off with the Dollar Tree, I picked up some of this fashion duct tape. It's like this camouflaged looking. I picked up two of those. And I picked up two in this um, rainbowy tie dyed print. I thought it was pretty, so I got two of those. Here's just what the tape looks like. And I picked one up in this pretty tie dyed piece looking. I picked up one more of these cow fans. I got this one for my stepmom for her birthday in August. Thought she would like that. I haven't put batteries in it yet. I picked up another one of these little plastic soft sided like containers. Um, I put some things in it. I decided that I needed one more. So I picked one of those up. Then I saw this soap saver um, home collection dish. I picked one of these up to use in the shower. I've seen people hauling these head wraps <clears throat> by Basic Solutions. Sorry. So I picked one of those up and I got one in more of the green, like little yellow color. It had several different ones, but I chose this one. And I picked up some of these Basic Solutions ribbon elastics. You get five of them for your hair. Um, I chose the chevron print. I thought it was the prettiest, and you get two that is not. I just picked up some of the batteries to put in the red solo cup lights. And I've never seen these candles at the Dollar Tree before. They're the natural vanilla scented candles. They just have no top. They look like that. I picked two of those up. They smell pretty good. And I picked up three of these storage containers. I got two of this green. And then I picked the bluish green. One of those up. They have the little handles on the end. I hadn't seen those in any of the other Dollar Trees, so... I got three of those, and that's everything for the Dollar Tree. It was just a small one. And then here are some things I got at the flea market Saturday. You guys had saw these hauled from the Dollar Tree. I could never find them, but the Hawaiian um, Tropic Shimmer Effects After Sun Moisturizer highlights your skin tone in coconut. Yeah, I could never find them. Well, I went to the flea market, and they had, you got three for $2.00. So I picked up two of these, and then I got the Hawaiian Tropic Sheer Touch Clear Spray Sunscreen in SPS 50. So I picked up all three of these for $2. I thought it was an awesome deal. Better than the Dollar Tree. And then I have not seen these in Forever Rabbit's Feet. So I don't know why. They were like a quarter each. So I picked up some. I got me a pretty green rabbit's foot. You know rabbit's feet are supposed to be good luck. And then I got my brother an orange one. And then I picked up my mom a purple one. I don't know, I just thought those were cool. I hadn't seen them in a long time. I picked up this sign. It was $5. I'm, I'm going to hang it on the door. It says welcome. It's in John Deere. And it has this detachable flag if you don't want the flag on there. And I just thought that was cute because I'm a John Deere fan. Then I found this reef for one dollar in the grapevine. And I just thought this was better quality than a dollar tree for a dollar. So I picked it up and I figured I could do some kind of crafting with that. Then I have a bathroom set with these um, hearts and stars and stuff. But my mom has it right now. I'm letting her use it because ours is in Bingles right now. And this set that goes with it is very expensive. So I've seen a lady have it at the flea market. For all of this for five dollars so I got a soap dispenser and I already have one so I figured I could put lotion in this one sorry about the noise in the background I got the toothbrush holder which I did not have and the last piece of that set was this beautiful Kleenex box and this like says on the bottom it retail for twenty dollars so I was happy to pick all of those up and then I did pick my mom up a Dooney and Burke purse for $5, but I already gave it to her. But I will show you the coach purse I found myself. 
just looks like this. Has a nice little coach tag. If the lady wanted $25 for it, but I got it for $20. It has nice braided handles. It has a little tag inside and stuff. And I don't know if it's real or not, but all the buckles all have the little coach emblem on them all over. So that's probably a good sign. But regardless, it looks like it's hardly got any wear. I thought it was really cute for 20 bucks. So I picked myself up that. And that's everything I have in this haul video. I hope everyone enjoyed it. And I hope everyone has a great week. And I will talk to everyone very soon.